All right, some of you are wanting to know how to name molecular compounds. I'm going to show you how to do that. Okay, name molecular compounds is kind of easy. You just don't deal with any metals. For example, uh, C O. Two. I think everybody knows what that is. That's a good one to start out with. Uh, list your elements that you have. You have carbon, which is the first one. The next one you have is oxygen. Okay, now molecular compounds are the ones you use the prefixes on. And if you remember on your prefixes, uh, one is mono, two, is di, three is tri, four is tetra, five is penta, that's a p, six is hexa, seven is hepta, eight is octa, nine is no, na, ten is deca, Okay, and these are the ones that we'll use. Just remember that <clears throat> the prefix mono is not used on the very first element named. It's never named. You know, it's never used mono. So if you just have one carbon like we have here, you would just use the word carbon. Anyway, the next part is the, the hard part. Uh, the oxygen. What you'll always have to do with it is uh, think about how many that you have here. Okay, and you've got two. So it's always wise to make a list of those. Okay, like how many you've got. You know, you got two, so you know you got dye here. Now on the carbon, you were right that you had only one. You would use mono, but remember, we don't use mono on the first one. So you just use the name carbon. Okay, but oxygen has to end in IDE. So what we'll do is we'll find the middle of the word oxygen. Okay, so O X Y G E N. Find the middle of it, right down through there. And you'll write it down twice, O, X, Y. That's the first middle. The second middle is O, X, Y, G. Knock off a letter, you know, go back, add a letter, O, X, Y, G, E. Add I, D, E to all these and pick the one that sounds the best. Okay, looking at this, this is oxy G, I. This is ox, J, I, oxy, I, but an oxide. Out of all those, the one that sounds the best is oxide. So basically, when we finally get ready to name this, this one will be named carbon dioxide. Dioxide. And that's how you name a molecular compound. We'll do another one in the next video.